Hi everybody, welcome to another painting episode. Today I'm going to paint Heaven's Portal. Okay, this one's almost just like the other one I just painted, except for it's done in black. It's going to have a nice uh, blue circle that's basically the portal that's at the top, and I'm going to kind of spin it, hopefully. And I'm going to paint this red and this yellow striped to have the nice striations fighting against the circle. Should look really good on the dot, hopefully. Now we're going to finish it off with a little bit of marbleizing. Here we go. Lindas Fabad. Here we go, people. Okay. Ooh. That kind of showing through there a little bit. That's kind of cool. So when I did this with the black, it kind of shows through. I kind of dig that. I don't know if I'm going to cover that. I kind of like the way that looks. Yeah, we're going to marbleize it. Because, yeah, as you know, I'm a marbleized freak. I like to marbleize. Everything is marbleized. But it did show through, and it is kind of neat. So, I don't know. I don't think I'm, the marble light, I don't think the marbleizer is going to hurt it any. Oh, this paint's thick. Okay, so I got pretty good coverage there. You know, as you know, red covers pretty well, but um, like I said, I let this one dry a little bit, so um, it showed some of that, uh, that texture that I put on with a plastic bag. I'm liking that. It looks pretty cool. Let me rinse my brush out. Really, when you're doing this, you want to probably start out with your light color first. Now I'm going to probably have some kind of like orange going on. <laughs> I could have used another brush too, but that's okay. We'll get it going. We don't care if it's orange. Well, I kind of do. I do care if it's orange. I don't want it too orange. Because what I'm really trying to do is get the complementaries here. You know, red, the yellow, and the blue going together on the black and the gray complements here. Okay, so that covers a little bit better. So, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and continue to marbleize. But I'm going to wait before I was hasty and I pulled it off too soon and it pulled the marbles, marbleization off. So I'm going to let it dry a little bit, sink in. Okay, so it's still kind of showing through. I kind of like that though. It's kind of cool. Kind of hard to see on film, I'm sure, but from where I'm sitting here, it's just, you can see some of that marbleization poking through, even though I'm using very opaque colors. Okay, liking that. Let's get rid of the brush. Okay, you know what? Let's get rid of that too. Might make a mess, a catastrophe. And, uh, I'm going to go ahead and marbleize it. Oh, Ooh, that's not hurting at all. It's just adding to it. I'm liking that a lot. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and use this one. So we'll offset it a little. A little silver. So I use silver because it's darker on the yellow get lighter on the red. See how cool that is? Okay, perfect. Like that. Let it dry. For, I'm going to let that dry for a bit. So, let me help it out. Let me help it out. Let me get the hair dryer going here. Woo! Boom. <laughs> okay, that's good. I don't want to over dry it. 
let's see what I got here. So I'm gonna pull some of that off. Uh, still, it's kind of full on it. So I'm gonna let it dry a little longer. Okay, so what, my, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start from here and work my way down. So let's do that now. I'm gonna go ahead and just let that stuff dry a little bit longer. Let's see. I don't know if I was pulling that off, but it's okay, I'll redo it if I have to. Okay, so I'm just not letting it dry long enough. Gonna be more patient. I don't have any patience, so I'm gonna let it dry a little bit. What I wanted to do is get a little closer to that line though, so that's kind of why I wanted that. But that, you know, I'm gonna leave it. I need to dry. So anyways, I put the sky blue paint in this cookie tin or whatever the heck it is, pie, cake pan, whatever. And I need it to dip this lid in. As you guys know, I use a lot of lids from the Goodwill and Salvation Army and places like that. It supports them and it gives me some cool tools to work with. So I'm just gonna roll around in here, that's the whole idea. I'm gonna bounce around so you can get any big old globs. Probably get some anyway, but. And I did spray this with water a little bit ahead of time. But what you wanna to try to do is get it to suck up some of that paint underneath so you can carry it across here. Okay, so I'm gonna start here. Oh, that's cool. Let's put some more in there. See how I'm doing that? It's cool. Isn't that wild? And you can just keep doing it, you know, just keep making those little. Look at that. Wow, look at that. That's cool. I like that. Put a little bit more thicker paint right about here because I'm going to make a drip. Yeah, I'm kind of liking that. Yes. Thicken it up towards the bottom here. I like to be thicker right about here. There we go. See that? It's getting a little thicker. A little thicker. A little bit thicker. That's perfect. There we go. I'm liking that. We just want a nice vibration of movement. See that? It's cool. Okay, so now that it's like that, let's go ahead and remove this tape. Woo! Cool as that. We don't want that to dry on us too much. Oh, there we go, there's that. And now I'm gonna do my little bit of a run here. Stand that up. And we're gonna wet it. Let it run. Gotta soak the crop out of it. Now I'm gonna what I'm gonna do also add more paint because I want that thing to drip more. Drip, damn it, drip, drip. There we go. See, I want it to drip. There we go. Perfect. I want it nice and messy. Perfect. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Soak the crap out of it. Who cares? We want a lot of movement in that drip. Let's get some more in there. See that? There we go. That's what I'm after. I want that thing to bleeding blue sky.
I'm liking that. I like that. I'm going to clean up the lid just a little bit because I don't want it too uh, full of uh, paint. What I'm going to do now is just kind of cut into it a little bit. Look at that, see that? I'm just cutting into it like it's making it. I'm liking that. It's got a lot of movement. There we go. And there you have it, Heaven's Portal. Thanks guys.